Plasma is the fourth state of matter. It's what happens when you heat beyond a gas. You ionize, you break apart the atom into its constituent nucleus and its electronic content. The nucleus is positively charged. It's made of protons and neutrons. And the electrons are just separate uh, individualistic particles. And there's another type of particle, which is very important, but we won't get into, called the neutrino. And that that's actually the only form of dark matter that we know for sure exists. So you've heard about dark matter. We've never observed any other dark matter in the universe besides a neutrino. But they're not relevant necessarily for either okay. life or what we have, right? You have this plasma yeah. of protons, electrons that aren't associating with one another. Now yes. that's a relatively uniform field of protons and electrons. It's super hot. Now it's only relatively uniform. It starts to clump together. And the reason it clumps together is because of gravitational attraction, right? It clumps together in material. I believe it's because of quantum uncertainty. It isn't 100% uniform. Some of these primordial particles are a little bit closer to others than others are. There's a, there's a slight non-uniformity about it. And now, and now you get clumping. The bigger the clump that emerges, the more likely it is to accrete additional matter. And then that keeps happening until you get the beginning of clumps of matter that are large enough to be stuck. And then the stars have enough gravitational force to produce additional nuclear trans or atomic transformations, and the stars start to generate the rest of the periodic table of the elements. 